Hello, Matt Weaver here with Cross Country Mortgage. This message is for homeowners, home shoppers, renters, real estate agents, and clients. I think we can agree that we are, of course, in a time of uncertainty. No one knows as to when this virus will stop its spreading, but what we can do is put full faith into this country on solving this problem and solving it quickly. It's just not in our personal control. But what is in our personal control is our personal financial situation and how we can position ourselves for years to come. I'm going to read off my notes here because I have some information that is very technical, but I would love for you to listen through the message in its entirety. First, allow me to provide some transparency as it relates to mortgage rates, the Federal Reserve cutting rates, and the overall banking system. One. Mortgage rates have hit an all-time low in the first week of March. When that happened, it caused a refinance surge like no other. In other words, millions of homeowners were calling into lending institutions to refinance their home. This caused much chaos and pandemonium and lenders simply could not keep up with the demand. Interestingly enough, March 9th, the following week through the 13th, mortgage rates actually went up and they went up to ward off this demand that just could not be met. On March 15th, the Federal Reserve came out and announced an interest rate cut using the language 0% to 0.25%. But what does that mean? That rate is specific to what's called the federal funds rate, which is the rate banks use to lend to one another, not mortgage rates. The cut also cuts what's called the federal prime rate. The federal prime rate is typically locked into or follows home equity lines of credit. So if you have a line of credit, congratulations, your rate came down significantly. The federal prime rate today is 3.25%. The Fed also announced its bond buying program, buying treasuries and mortgage backed securities. What does that mean? That simply means that it's the Federal Reserve's way of pumping more money back into the banking system to stay afloat and to keep up with demand. The day after the cut, March 16th, Monday, interest rates actually started trickling down a little bit from going up the week before. Now, we are at historic lows here once again. How long this will last, we just don't know. Homeowners, my message to you is very clear. If you plan on being in your home for greater than 36 months, pull out your mortgage statement, take a look at it, and give us a call or use our simple system. We came up with a very quick, efficient system called Snap, Send, Save, meaning snap a picture of your mortgage statement, send it through our secured link, and we will call you with what your potential savings could be. It's that simple. For homeowners that are not in their ideal home and plan on perhaps moving over the next 12 to 24 months, this is the time to find out what your value is, what you can sell for, because you can sell high and borrow low in this marketplace. We have a five step simple exercise that we can send you to see if you can in fact purchase your ideal home. Home shoppers, your timing could not be any better, but I want to heed caution in one way. Number one, make sure you're dealing with a lender that has a thorough pre-approval process up front. Lenders in today's market are gonna take shortcuts. They're not gonna review documents just so they can quickly get you on your way. And this can cause issues when shopping for a home. Think about it. In addition to that, most mortgage lenders cannot close timely today due to overwhelming volume. We are poised in position at Cross Country, the Matt Weaver team, to be able to do so. Renters, your money is already in the game, meaning with the housing world, there's no cash position. You need a roof over your head. I would encourage you to pick up the phone and have a conversation as to what your rental dollars can bring you in terms of ownership. And lastly, the overall real estate market, I happen to believe our overall real estate market is poised and positioned to remain solid. 
borrowing costs are at their low. The Federal Reserve intervened and brought rates overall down, which pumps money back into our system. Now is the time for us to put our friends, our family, and ourselves into a better position. Stay safe, my friends. My team and I are available to you seven days a week from 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. That's right, 8 a.m. to 9 p.m., seven days a week at 561-864-2458. Thank you.